Hey there guys and welcome back to God of War. In the last part we were somewhere in the cliffs of madness and Whoa, those Minotaurs have pretty big axes. Why can't Kratos use those? That would be pretty awesome, like if Kratos could pick up weapons from the enemies he's killed. Like I'd love to see him swing an axe like that. Or maybe that Satyr staff. Although he has a weapon kinda like that in God of War 2. But I don't think I really use it all that much in that LP because it kinda sucks. Yeah, Blade of Artemis time, cause this is taking too long and the Blade of Artemis makes everything shorter. Including the Minotaurs, it makes them shorter a few feet by chopping off their heads. I mean, if chopping off your head doesn't make you shorter, I don't know what does. Maybe chopping off your legs or something. But chopping off their heads is easier because chopping off legs doesn't always kill. It's a statue of Hera, it appears as if she once wore a necklace. And a statue of Aphrodite, she also wore a necklace. Okay, my guess is I need to find these necklaces maybe? But where do we go? Uh, yeah, that's... A, I mean, there's a ladder there. Okay, maybe we found it. Uh, oh boy. Okay, this looks like a really safe... Oh crap, two of them. And archers. Yep, better whip out the blade for this one. It's time to bring out the heavy guns. Uh, I need help. Oh crappy almost. It's a good thing there's invisible walls everywhere, otherwise I would have been dead really easily. Now come on, stop jumping around like a faggot and just stand still and let me cut you in half. All the while the archers are still taking pot shots at me with their bloody explosive arrows. Oh, that was a nice one. I love the overhead swing, it's so cool looking and powerful. And stop dodging, you're like freaking Yoda. Twirling and spinning all over the place. Okay, problem solved, and now to kill those guys. Ah, lightning, you're so helpful. Okay, what's in here? Phoenix feather, I guess, so just red orbs. Alright, slide on the rope like we're Tarzan. Although that's not really how Tarzan does it. He, like, swings on them rather than glides off of them. Well, whatever. Oh, this looks... Yep, yeah, archers, or er, wait, soldiers. And archers. Freaking combination of them. And a Minotaur as well. This looks like a good moment for the army of Hades. I mean, see, that magic owns everything. Although, of course, the enemies always freaking respawn. And kill the archers. How many freaking enemies are there here? Come on. There we go, I can even knock a Minotaur into the air. That's how strong Kratos is. And there goes his head. Better take the magic just in case we need to use the army of Hades again sometime soon. If we can ever get trapped by enemies again. That's the ultimate Deus Ex Machina magic. Because it pretty much always helps you win against overwhelming groups of enemies. Ah, so satisfying. Come here, you. Wanna take off your head. And wear it like a helmet. Although Kratos can't really do that. Although they did have like a pretty cool pre-order commercial for GameSpot or something. Where Kratos was wearing like the GameSpot exclusive pre-order costume and he was like talking to the Chimera. And the Chimera's all like, Dude, Kratos, that's a cool getup. What's it made of? And then Kratos are like, oh, the helmet's uh, a goat skull. The boots are made of snake leather and the jacket or torso armor or whatever is made from lion fur. And the Chimera's all like, what the F? And then Kratos kills it. Like, yeah, that's a real freaking funny commercial, so look it up sometime. Maybe I'll put a link in the description if I can be bothered. 
Anyways, this is another mind-racking puzzle. And as you can see, I did not get it from the get-go. There's a whole bunch of rocks here, no. A lever, and the lever twirls at a game. Oh, now I figured it out. I think... Okay... Pushing the lever doesn't seem to be changing anything. But... Oh, what's this? Like my soul has been shattered, your path forward is fragmented. Rebuild my soul and open the path. Yup, it's... A puzzle. Kinda like Tetris or something, like match the shapes in the holes and... Hope you're right. Anyways, better yank these things up on the spinning platform. Because I need to turn them sideways for them to even fit in there properly. Get on there. Get the bloody lever. Give it a whirl. Wait, what? It doesn't stick? That's lame, man. No, 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 no. Okay. That was kind of weird. But I guess it works. Come on. Okay, it's obvious these go together. Yeah. And then... Oh, wait. We need to push him all the way into the back wall. Okay, that makes sense. Because there's that little thing there already. Okay, that's in. Uh, this block. It's a big straight one. Could go anywhere. Probably needs to go all the way over there. Just a hunch. And a kick. Oh, that wasn't helpful at all. Come on, Kratos, you can kick it harder than that. Alright, that's in. This one obviously goes in here. I reckon... Yes, yes it does. Okay, that one obviously needs to be turned around. And what's this? What, we have like one extra block or something? Uh, that's kind of weird. I mean, this one fits over here. And then the big one over there will fit in that gap if I turn it around. Then what's the small one over there for? That does not make much sense. Why would there be an extra block? Anyways, spin this one around. Come on. And let's just hope it sticks. Okay, it does. Uh, this dragging takes way too long. I mean, come on, Kratos. You're like the freaking strongest human ever. You're like... The best Spartan and the Spartans are the, were the best of the best in ancient Greece, so... Okay, I assembled everything, I think. Where do... I think this one goes over here. There's like... Some kind of cavity or something. Whatever. Uh, but there seems to be some kind of symbol on that door. And if they can see some lines on the rock, maybe it's nothing, but... What if I turn this one around? Maybe... So maybe there's like some of those lines on the other side. Well, that does seem to follow a pattern of some kind. Kinda looks like a nose and a mouth or something. If you look at it from a weird angle. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's where it goes. Wait. 
Okay, it does fit. There we go. Now what? Or did I maybe assemble it wrong? Nah, I'm fairly certain I put it everything in right. Oh, maybe that's it. Maybe I just didn't push the things in all the way. That would kind of make sense. Yeah, see, it's probably that. Screw the idea I had about patterns or lines. But anyway, there's the first necklace. Yes, we would like to take the necklace. That's why we're here in the first place. We've got the necklace of Hera. And now we can go back out. And the ladder drops down again. By a ghost. Ooh. Okay, never mind that. And no enemies. That's swell. Alright, let's find this bloody ladder and get out of here. Mm -hmm. Oh, save room. Okay, we'll just uh, save up here. And then we will continue our epic quest in the mythical world of ancient Greece in the next part of God of War. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next part. Bye bye.